welcome friends in this tutorial we will learn how can we implement the lookup functionality in our SSRS report so what is lookup actually lookup is nothing more than uh, using two different table having relationship between primary key and foreign key it's the same thing could be possible in SSRS report so in SSRS report we can understand that the, we have two data set one data set have all the employee information such as employee ID employee name and country code we have another data set we can call it as a country master in country master we have two columns country code and country name so the same scenario uh, we are looking here now we have a country master you can see the air country code and country name and we have an other table like an employee in empl employee employee ID employee name and country code what we need to do we need to so country code we need to show country code uh, from country table so what we can do here country code is common in both tables so we need to pull the country name based on, on the country code so in reports what we are going to do here we have the data set source which is you to connect our data base now you can see here now first of all what we are going here we are going to add a data set called DS employee okay and we are using the share data source here so we need to pull all the column from employee master so we are using employee table here now we can use employee id employee name and country code ok and execute the query now you can see here we have the data set having all the stuff fails now you can see here yeah okay now what we need to do here we need to add a table in our report yeah now we have a table okay now in this table we need to use data set so for this data set we are using the mm, 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 data set name as a this employee okay and put the employee id employee name and country code now you can see here and preview the report okay you can see here now what we can do here now we want to display country name instead of country code so we are using country name ok now but we yeah you can see here country code now we need to create add another data set call it ds country ds country I use the shared data set ok in query designer we are going to use add table feature and add a country table country code country name ok and run the query here you can see here all the country are listing with country code ok click on ok button yeah 
now what we need to do we have country code in both table both data set and we need to pull this country name from this ds country data set so we are going to use lookup feature here now you can right click on the and go to the expression okay now you can see here now we are going to expression okay <coughs> sorry <coughs> sorry we are using to use lookup okay lookup this is the first feature now we are going to use another data set that is data set ds country so we are using to going to use country code here okay yeah okay and what we need to do here we need to use yeah country name so this is the country name now we need to pull the pass the ds country that means this is the first value which is coming from employee the second value that is i mean to say you can use it as a foreign key and the value from the second data set okay click on okay just preview the report now you can see here now this is very common thing yeah this is the lookup so lookup is very easy you can see here that is Canada Canada China China have the same thing okay so for the better understanding we can add another column into the right for example we are going to use the country code okay now preview the report you can see here so this is the simple thing how we can implement the lookup in our report okay hope hope i hope that this tutorial is helpful to us and all the developer and the report designer how we can use the lookup feature in our report okay this is the one thing